I mean, he's the president's son. All right. And the president is in charge of the DOJ. Now, they will argue, hey, look, it's the same investigator. David Weiss was appointed under Trump, so it's not like we changed investigators. But can you imagine the pressure right now? Think about it. I mean, think about what happened during the election and those 51 ex-spies, those spooks that came out, total political hacks, and issued that letter to Politico saying, Oh, there's nothing to see here. No, Hunter Biden's not being investigated by the FBI when, in fact, he was. So you can understand why the American public has more questions. But no, they just want to make it like those bad, bad conservatives, those Republicans. Look at what they're doing. Look at what they're doing to Hunter Biden. And you see... The president, of course, carrying on that narrative, all he's saying is, I'm so proud of my son. I'm proud of my... You're proud of him? Really? Like, I, I, I'm not so sure you should be so proud of him, sir. This was him on MSNBC, the president of the United States, just a few months ago with the same, same sort of train of thought. I'm proud of him. I'm proud of him. But he also said something else pretty interesting. And this, I promise you, is going to come back to haunt him. Watch. First of all, my son's done nothing wrong. I trust him. I have faith in him. And it impacts my presidency by making me feel proud. (laughs) The reporter had asked, hey, you know, how does this impact your presidency? His response is, it just makes me more proud, right? It impacts me by making me more proud of my son. And he did say he did nothing wrong. Well, if he did nothing wrong, why is he pleading to these two minor charges. 